A pinpoint report is the best way to get a detailed understanding of the area around any piece of real estate. Along with a robust demographic picture of the trade area, they can also be used to understand the retail landscape, look at traffic volumes, map out your competitor's network, and understand the geosocial behaviors of the neighborhood. To create a report, you first need to designate a trade area. There are a few ways to do this. You can either start around a specific address by using the search bar or by right-clicking on the map. Or you can use the trade area drawing tool to draw a ring, drive time, walk time, or polygon on the map to represent the area you'd like to analyze. Let's use the walk time tool to analyze the area within a 15 minute walk of Fulton Market in Chicago. Navigate to the top of your screen and click the trade area drop down selector and click walk time. Then drop it on the center of the Fulton Market to start the walk time. It will default to 5 minutes, but we can use the custom size box to select 15 minutes, then click the check mark to visualize it and the save button to save it to the map. Next, we want to make sure we have the target market and points of interest panels loaded up with any demographics and points of interest we would like included in our report. If you have geosocial data added to your account, you can also look at the social behaviors prominent around your report's location. Once you are ready to build your report, simply click on the trade area shape you have drawn and select Build a Report from the menu that comes up. You now have the option to name your report and add in any of your own data points that you have loaded into the Layers panel. Make sure that all of the demographics and points of interest that you would like included are selected and then click Create Report. Your report will load in another tab. Every report you create will have several sections, each digging into a different aspect of the trade area. The overview section gives a general breakdown of your custom demographics, along with some comparisons to the surrounding county and details about the retail landscape. On the demographics tab, you will find a detailed breakdown of exactly who lives in the trade area, how old they are, how much money they make, and more. In the points of interest section, you will see a breakdown of each of the points of interest brands and categories that you have brought into your report. If you have custom layers you have added to your report, they will appear here as well. Not only can you learn exactly how far away each of your potential competitors might be, but you can also get a sense of how saturated the market is with our saturation cards. And lastly, if you have your own locations uploaded to Pinpoint, you will have a My Location section, which will show you the characteristics of each of your stores or properties nearby. All the data in the report can be shared with a colleague or a client in its interactive online format using the Share button. You also have the option to print or save it, or export the demographic points of interest information to Excel. Pinpoint reports are a powerful tool in your location analytics arsenal. In this short video, we've only scratched the surface, but we'd love for you to book a session with your customer success manager to learn more. Thanks.